welcome to another episode of Spice All the Foods here on Brino's World, the show where I take common, ordinary, ready-to-eat food items and improve them by spicing them up. On this episode, I took a trip to the local Burger King and got me an order of some famous chicken fries. Uh, these are kind of bland and ready by themselves, not a whole lot of chicken to speak of. Let's see if we can't add some hot sauces and improve that. Leading us off, we have a package of buffalo sauce that came with the chicken fries from Burger King. Let's have a little dip in here. All right, so leading us off, Burger King's buffalo wing sauce with the chicken fry. Here we go. much like every single buffalo wing sauce that you will get from a fast food restaurant or from a grocery store of the mild variety a little bit of kick to it but not a whole lot very very buttery very fatty in flavor not that that's a bad thing but if you want something really really hot and spicy or just something unique and spicy this is probably not what you want so up next we have some sriracha very very famous type of um asian type of hot sauce goes well with lots and lots of things let's see how well it goes with a burger king chicken fry so let's drizzle that on here there we go appropriately topped so burger king chicken fry with sriracha. Here we go. Hmm. Hmm. Oh wow. That is nice. It's got the right amount of heat to it, plus it's got a lot of other flavors going on in there. Um get a hint of garlic as well. I think that's one of the ingredients here in sriracha. Oh yep. Plenty of garlic, vinegar. I'm getting all of those flavors here in the sriracha. Burger King chicken fries go excellent with sriracha sauce. I don't remember if that was one of the options they had at Burger King, but if anyone from Burger King's watching, offer a sriracha with your chicken fries. It's very, very good. You will not regret it. It's a good move. Whoop, let's march on forward. Next on the line, we have Mrs. Renfro's Ghost Pepper Barbecue Sauce. I've used this before when I tried to spice up some Chicken McNuggets. Didn't work so well. Let's see if it'll do any better with the chicken fry. One good thing about the fries is that they're long, so you can just roll them around in the sauce like so. So there we go. A little bit of drippings there, but that's okay. So here we are, chicken fry and ghost pepper barbecue. Here we go. It's a little better. Not as good as the sriracha though. The normal barbecue sauce by itself, it's a little bit, oh, and one of my lights just went out. Sorry about that. But anyway, as I was saying, Barbecue sauce by itself is a little bit on the uh, bland, not bland side, but it's got a generic flavor and the heat of the ghost pepper doesn't kick in until a little bit later, so you can't get that enjoyment right away. Plus, I'm using this barbecue sauce cold, so that doesn't really help things out either. Well, maybe it does, I don't know. But the, does the ghost pepper barbecue sauce improve a chicken fry? Slightly, but not by much. Lastly, a product which I'm familiar with, all too, all too familiar with, from the Pepper Palace, their Scorpion Chicken Wing Sauce. This is their version of the Buffalo Sauce, although kicked up to 10. And I am down to my last chicken fry. Nothing more after this. So this one better work. I hope it works. Let's get a good 
amount of scorpion sauce on here. But yeah, after doing death by wings a couple times, I'm not doing that again, so went to its less spicy cousin. But anyway, let's go. Scorpion pepper wing sauce on the chicken fry. Here we go. Ooh. Ah, crap. Oh my god, here comes that heat again. Here comes heat. Screw it. Mm. I'm sweating. If I was sweating both before, I'm sweating even more now. Oh. Not as bad as the Death by Wings, obviously. But it's still pretty, pretty hot. Oh. Sweat. Pouring on the face. So many hot sauces at once. But it's kind of similar to the um, Burger King Buffalo Wing sauce, except not as buttery and a lot more spicy. It's also got the same problem as the ghost pepper barbecue sauce in that the heat of the super hot doesn't kick in immediately. So you just get like the buttery, fatty flavor that the wing sauce provides. Though not as much of it as Burger King does because BK probably lines hers up with fatty stuff to make it taste better. Again, good, better, but only by a little. If I had to pick a winner out of all four of these sauces, it would have to be the sriracha sauce, hands down. It, the sriracha sauce itself has a lot of good flavor. It's got a lot of good heat. You know, the chili, the garlic, the vinegar, you get all those flavors in there. And they mix very well with the batter and the filling of the chicken fry. So if you want to find a way to improve your Burger King chicken fries and you haven't had some sriracha sauce around, do that. Otherwise, go to the store and get some. That will do it for another episode of the Spice All the Foods here on Brino's World. Thank you for watching. And if you've got any ideas of foods that can be improved with some heat, leave a comment down below. Otherwise, don't forget to like and share this video and subscribe to Brino's World. Thank you very much for watching. Have yourself a good one.